Some parents and students in the South Bay also took part in today's statewide protest. Our ABC 10 News reporter Rena Nakano spoke to parents who say they are ready to pull their children out of school for good. It was recess all day Monday for these kids who skipped school. My husband and I will have no other choice but to pull them. Mom of three, Courtney Sewell, says she stands with parents statewide who are against the governor's plan to require the COVID-19 vaccine to all kids once the shots are given full FDA approval, which could happen as soon as January. We won't do it. We will not give it to our kids. And so you leave us no choice but to withdraw all of them. Parents say what you see here could be a precursor of what's to happen if the mandate goes through. I think it's about trying to get our voices heard and hit them where it hurts with the in the pockets. According to the California Department of Education, the current cost of education per student in 2020 in the Chula Vista Elementary or Sweetwater Unified Districts was more than $12,000, a big loss to the districts if students leave. And we're seeing that these vaccines are safe. Dr. Joe Tusandu with Sharpery Steely hopes these parents reconsider. It's really important uh, that everybody who is eligible to get vaccinated be vaccinated. So we asked. How many of you parents are vaccinated? <laughs> How many parents and kids are vaccinated for other stuff? Parents here say they're not anti-vaxxers. They just don't want to be told to get this specific vaccine. This is, should be our freedom of choice, period. And I honestly don't think that it really goes beyond that. Dr. Sandu says he believes parents should focus on science and the greater good. It really kind of took it away from a medical issue into a polarizing political one. And we think about infectious disease. We have to take our minds away from me, 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 and think of it more as us. In Bonita, I'm Rena Nakano, ABC 10 News. And like with other required school vaccines, parents still do have the option to opt out of the mandate for religious or medical reasons.